You are not here by chance. You are here for a reason. You are right where you need to be right now, at this very moment. That you're listening to these words means you're ready for a change. This is a sign that you're ready to change your life in ways you've never imagined possible. Imagine what drew you here today. Was it curiosity, an unexplainable feeling that something is missing in your life, or was it a deep, unexplainable urge to find something more? Whatever it was, know this. That feeling, that impulse, it's your inner wisdom. Your body, your mind, your whole being is saying it's time to change. It's time to come out of your slumber. It's time to get into a new chapter of your life where you can accomplish more than you ever thought you could. Therefore, spend a moment and think about why you are here and what you are looking for. This is your opportunity to change your life for the better, and you start by recognizing that you are ready for this transformation. Before we dive in, take a powerful step by declaring your intention. Let the universe know you are ready for all the wealth and success ahead. Writing it down makes it even stronger, so please comment with, I win big and financial abundance follows. You might be thinking, this all sounds great, but I've tried to make changes before and nothing worked. I get it. I understand. Here's the thing. If you're not seeing the results you want, it's not because this principle doesn't work. It's because your thoughts, feelings, and actions aren't fully aligned with what you truly desire. Think about it. How often do you say you want something, but your thoughts and actions are completely at odds with that desire? You say you want to be healthy, but you keep eating unhealthy foods. You say you want financial abundance, but you're always worrying about money. You say you want a loving relationship, but deep down, you don't believe you're worthy of love. Now, some of you might be thinking, but isn't this just daydreaming? How can imagining something make it real? I understand why it might seem that way. It can feel too simple or too good to be true. But here's the thing. Everything in our physical world started as a thought, an idea in someone's mind. The chair you're sitting on, the device you're using to listen to this, the building you're in, all of these things existed as ideas before they became real. Someone had to imagine them first, believe they were possible, and then take action to make them real. So, how do we create this alignment? It starts with awareness. Awareness of your thoughts, emotions, and beliefs. You need to become a keen observer of your inner world. Start paying attention to the thoughts that run through your mind throughout the day. Are they supportive of your goals and dreams, or are they negative, limiting beliefs that hold you back? Notice the emotions you feel most often. Are they empowering emotions like joy, gratitude, and excitement? Or are they draining emotions like fear, anger, and resentment? This misalignment, the gap between what you say you want and what you truly believe is possible for you, is what's holding you back. It's what's keeping you stuck in old patterns and old realities. But here's the good news. You can bridge that gap. You can align your thoughts, feelings, and actions with your desires. And when you do, when you achieve that alignment, that's when you start to see real, tangible changes in your life. Every single one of us has the power to shape our reality. We're not victims of our circumstances. We're not bound by our past. We're creators, shapers of our own lives. And the tool we use to shape our reality is our mind. Your thoughts, your beliefs, your emotions, they're not just responses to the world around you, they're creating the world around you. Every thought you think, every belief you hold, every emotion you feel is sending a signal out into the universe and the universe responds. It's like a giant cosmic mirror reflecting back to you exactly what you're projecting. But you're different. You're here, listening. You're ready to break free from old patterns and create a new reality. Let me tell you, not only is it possible, but it's also your birthright. If you're enjoying this, don't forget to subscribe. It's free and keeps you in the loop for more great content. It all starts with a daily practice, a practice of consciously choosing your thoughts and emotions, a practice of visualizing the reality you want to create, a practice of feeling the emotions associated with that reality as if it's already happened. Here's what I want you to do. 
Start each day with a simple meditation. Find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed. Sit comfortably, close your eyes, and take a few deep breaths. Now, think about your ideal life. What does it look like? What are you doing? How do you feel? See it in your mind's eye as vividly as you can. Use all your senses. What do you see? What do you hear? What do you smell? What do you feel? Make it as real as possible in your mind. We've been conditioned our entire lives to think and feel in certain ways. Our brains have created neural pathways, habits of thought and emotion, that can feel impossible to break. But here's the thing. Your brain is not fixed. It's not set in stone. It's plastic, malleable. It can change, and you have the power to change it. This is where the concept of neuroplasticity comes in. Neuroplasticity is your brain's ability to reorganize itself by forming new neural connections throughout life. It means that you can literally rewire your brain through your thoughts and experiences. This isn't just about visualizing and feeling. It's also about becoming aware of and changing your habitual thoughts and behaviors throughout the day. Pay attention to your self-talk. When you catch yourself thinking negative or limiting thoughts, stop, take a breath, and choose a different thought. For example, if you catch yourself thinking, I'm not good enough, stop, take a breath, and replace it with, I am constantly growing and improving. If you find yourself worrying about money, stop, take a breath, and instead think, I am open to abundant opportunities. These small actions might not seem significant on their own, but they add up. These challenges, these resistances, they're not signs of failure. They're signs of growth. They indicate that you're pushing beyond your comfort zone and truly changing. So, when you face these challenges, don't give up. Instead, see them as opportunities to reinforce your new beliefs and prove to yourself that you're committed to your new reality. If you slip back into an old pattern, don't be too hard on yourself. Gently guide yourself back to your new way of thinking and being. But here's something important to understand. This resistance is normal. It's part of the process. Your old self, your old identity, doesn't want to change. It's comfortable with what it knows, even if that's not serving you well. So it will fight back, trying to pull you into old patterns. This is where many people give up. They encounter resistance and think, see, I knew it wouldn't work. I knew I couldn't change. Start each day with a meditation. Visualize your ideal life and feel the emotions of having already achieved it. As you go through your day, stay aware of your thoughts and emotions. When you catch yourself slipping into old patterns, gently bring yourself back to your new reality. When you start to change your thoughts, emotions, and behaviors, the world around you will start to change too. You'll begin to notice opportunities that you never saw before. You'll start to attract people and experiences that align with your new reality. This isn't magic, it's just a result of your changed perception. When you change the way you see the world, the world you see changes. You've probably experienced this before, like when you buy a new car and suddenly you start seeing that same model everywhere. The cars were always there, but you never noticed them before because they weren't relevant to you. Now that you own one, your brain is tuned to notice them. The same thing happens when you start to embody your new reality. You become tuned to notice opportunities, people, and experiences that align with it. And because you notice them, you're more likely to take action on them and move closer to your goals. As you begin this journey of transformation, you might encounter resistance or challenges. You might have days where you slip back into old patterns of thinking and behaving. Remember, transformation is not a linear process. It's more like a spiral. You might revisit old patterns or challenges, but each time you do, you're approaching them from a higher level of awareness. You're stronger and more equipped to handle them. Neuroplasticity, the brain's ability to rewire itself, means you can change. Every day that you consciously choose new thoughts, new emotions, and new actions, you're rewiring your brain. You're building the new version of yourself that aligns with your desired reality. 
but it requires consistent effort. Just like going to the gym, where one workout won't make you fit, this mental and emotional fitness takes repetition. Keep at it. In the process of transforming yourself, remember to be kind to yourself. Don't expect perfection. There will be days when old patterns resurface, but that's not a sign of failure. It's a sign of growth. Think of it like peeling layers of an onion. Each layer you peel brings you closer to the core of who you are and who you're becoming. The deeper you go, the more transformation occurs. Your thoughts, your beliefs, and your emotions aren't just abstract things. They're powerful tools that are shaping your world. With practice, they'll no longer be random, habitual reactions to the world around you. Instead, they'll become the conscious creators of the world around you. So, keep practicing. Every positive thought, every empowering emotion, every action aligned with your vision brings you one step closer to becoming the person you're meant to be. Now, let's discuss the small changes that can lead to big transformations. If you're looking to create a new reality, it all begins with your daily habits. These don't have to be major overhauls, just small, consistent actions that align with your vision. For example, if your goal is better health, start with something as simple as drinking an extra glass of water each day or taking a 15-minute walk. If you're aiming for financial abundance, begin by saving a small amount of money regularly or spending a few minutes each day learning a new skill related to your work. These small steps may seem insignificant on their own, but they build momentum and, more importantly, they reinforce your new beliefs about what's possible for you. By making these tiny adjustments, you're setting the stage for larger, more significant changes down the line. So, start small and be consistent, and you'll be amazed at how these little actions can add up to make a big difference in your life. Let's talk about the small changes that can lead to big transformations. If you're looking to create a new reality, it starts with your daily habits. These don't have to be huge changes, just small, consistent actions that align with your vision. For example, if your goal is better health, start by doing something simple like drinking an extra glass of water each day or taking a short 15-minute walk. If you're aiming for financial abundance, begin by saving a small amount of money regularly or spending a few minutes each day learning a new skill related to your work. These small steps build momentum and reinforce your new beliefs about what's possible for you. The same principle applies to your self-talk. When you catch yourself thinking, I'm not good enough, replace it with, I am growing every day. If you find yourself worrying about money, take a deep breath and think, abundant opportunities are coming my way. These shifts may seem small, but they are crucial for rewiring your brain and aligning your actions with your desires. Your brain is incredibly flexible. It can change. This is where neuroplasticity comes in, which is your brain's ability to reorganize itself and create new neural pathways. Every time you choose a new thought or focus on a different emotion, you're literally rewiring your brain. The more you reinforce these new pathways, the stronger they become, eventually replacing old patterns. This is why your thoughts and emotions are so vital. They shape your brain and consequently, your life. Transformation isn't always a straight path. It's often more like a spiral. You might revisit old patterns, but each time you do, you're approaching them from a new level of awareness. Each challenge you face is an opportunity for growth, not failure. So, when you encounter resistance, whether it's slipping back into old habits or facing external obstacles, don't give up. Instead, see it as a sign that you're growing and moving beyond your comfort zone. As you continue on this journey, you might notice that the world around you starts to shift. Suddenly, you begin to see opportunities where none seem to exist before. People who align with your new energy will start to appear, and doors you hadn't noticed might begin to open. This isn't magic. It's a change in perception. The opportunities were always there, but now that you're aligning yourself with your vision, your brain is tuned to notice them. Think about a time when you got a new car and suddenly you started seeing the same model everywhere. It's not that everyone else bought the same car at the same time, it's just that now your brain is tuned in 
to notice that particular model. The same thing happens when you shift your thoughts and emotions toward your goals. You become tuned to recognize people, opportunities, and experiences that align with your desires, and as a result, you're more likely to take action. Every thought, every belief, and every action sends out a signal to the universe. The universe, in turn, mirrors that energy back to you, reflecting your internal state in your external reality. It's like a giant cosmic mirror showing you what you're projecting. When you align your thoughts, emotions, and actions with what you truly desire, the universe responds by bringing those things into your life. However, this process takes time and requires patience and persistence. Just like going to the gym, one workout won't transform your body, but consistent effort over time will. The same principle applies to your mental and emotional fitness. Each time you consciously choose a positive thought over a negative one, or take an action that aligns with your vision. You're building new habits, new beliefs, and a new reality. Now, let's dive deeper into the power of visualization. This isn't just about imagining something and hoping it happens. It's about feeling the emotions of having already achieved your goals. Your brain doesn't know the difference between a real experience and a vividly imagined one. So when you vividly imagine your desired future, your brain and body respond as if it's already happening. They begin to align with this new reality, which in turn makes you more likely to take the actions necessary to bring it into being. Each morning, find a quiet place and spend a few moments in meditation. Close your eyes, take deep breaths, and visualize your ideal life, what it looks like, what you're doing, how it feels. Use all your senses to make this vision as real as possible. What do you see? What do you hear? What do you smell? How does it feel in your body to be living this reality? Focus on the emotions that arise, whether it's joy, excitement, or gratitude, and let those feelings fill your body. If this is resonating with you, subscribe now. It's free and helps us bring even more value your way. As you go through your day, stay aware of your thoughts and emotions. When you catch yourself slipping into old patterns, gently bring yourself back to the present moment and realign with your vision. It's okay to slip up. What matters is that you consistently bring yourself back to the new way of being. Over time, these new thoughts and emotions will become your default state. You will encounter resistance on this journey, both internally and externally. Your old habits and beliefs might try to pull you back into your comfort zone, and people around you might not understand or support the changes you're making. This is normal and part of the process. It's important to stay focused on your vision and remember why you started. Challenges and setbacks are part of the growth process. They're opportunities to reinforce your commitment to your new reality. And it's not just about your thoughts and emotions. Your actions matter too. If you say you want financial abundance, but your actions are rooted in fear or scarcity, you're sending mixed signals. Your actions need to align with your desires. This might mean taking small, consistent steps toward your goal. If you want to be healthier, commit to making one small change, like drinking more water or adding more vegetables to your meals. These small, positive actions add up over time and signal to your subconscious mind that you're serious about the changes you want to make. It's easy to feel discouraged when you don't see immediate results, but remember that transformation takes time. The efforts you put in today will pay off tomorrow. You might not see the changes happening right away, but they are taking place beneath the surface, just like a seed grows underground before it sprouts. Trust that the work you're doing now will lead to the changes you desire, even if they're not visible yet. As you continue on this journey, one of the most important things to keep in mind is consistency. Transformation isn't about making big, sudden changes. It's about the small daily choices that add up over time. Each positive thought and each action that aligns with your goals is like adding a brick to the foundation of your new reality. The more you do this, the stronger your new life becomes. So, even when it feels like nothing is changing, trust that the work you're doing is laying the groundwork for the future you want to create. 
when challenges come, and they will, don't see them as setbacks. Instead, view them as opportunities for growth. Every obstacle is a chance to reinforce your new mindset and push beyond your old limits. You may revisit old patterns, but each time you do, you approach them with greater awareness. You're no longer stuck in the same loop. You're spiraling upward, gaining strength and clarity with each turn. The key is to keep moving forward, no matter how slow the progress might seem. As you continue to grow, you'll start to see the world around you change in ways that align with your inner transformation. Suddenly, you'll notice opportunities, connections, and people that seem to support your growth. This isn't magic, it's a shift in your perception. The opportunities were always there, but now you're tuned in to notice them because you've changed the way you see yourself and your life. When you begin to embody your new reality, the external world starts to mirror that change. Creating a supportive environment will also help you stay consistent. Look around at your surroundings. Does your home, your workspace, or the people you spend time with reflect the new reality you're trying to create? If not, start making small changes. Declutter your space, add elements that inspire you, and seek out people who encourage your growth. Your environment has a significant impact on your thoughts and emotions, so it's important that it supports the transformation you're undergoing. Remember, you're not just doing this for yourself. As you transform, you also inspire others to do the same. The changes you make in your life ripple out into the world around you. When people see you living your truth and embodying your highest potential, it gives them permission to do the same. Your personal growth has a positive effect on everyone you interact with. Think of it as a ripple effect. By becoming the best version of yourself, you're contributing to the collective growth of humanity. Visualization remains a powerful tool in this process. Start each day by closing your eyes, taking a few deep breaths, and imagining the life you want to create. Picture it in as much detail as possible. Feel the emotions of already living in that reality, whether it's joy, gratitude, or excitement. The more vivid you can make it, the more real it becomes to your subconscious mind. This is more than just daydreaming. When you visualize your ideal life and feel the emotions that come with it, you're sending strong signals to your subconscious mind and the universe. You're essentially telling them, this is my reality. And when your mind starts to believe in this new reality, you'll begin to take actions that align with it. Your thoughts, emotions, and actions will all start moving you closer to your goals. It's all about creating that inner alignment. Now, let's talk about resistance. Resistance often pops up when you're on the verge of a breakthrough. It's that voice in your head saying you can't change, that things will never be different, or that it's too hard. This is normal. It's your old self clinging to the comfort of what's familiar, even if it's not serving you anymore. When resistance shows up, acknowledge it, but don't let it stop you. Recognize that it's part of the process and keep moving forward. When you slip back into old patterns, and you will, don't be too hard on yourself. Be gentle and understanding. This journey isn't about perfection. It's about progress. Each time you catch yourself falling into old habits, pause, take a deep breath, and realign with your new way of thinking. Over time, these new habits will become second nature, but in the beginning, it requires patience and persistence. One of the most powerful things you can do is to maintain an attitude of gratitude. Gratitude aligns you with abundance and shifts your focus from what you lack to what you already have. Every day, take a moment to reflect on what you're grateful for. Even if things aren't perfect yet, there's always something to appreciate. This shift in perspective not only helps you stay positive, but also opens the door for more good things to flow into your life. Don't forget to celebrate the small wins along the way. Did you make a healthier choice today? Did you catch yourself thinking positively instead of slipping into negativity? Celebrate that. These little victories add up and reinforce the belief that you're capable of change. Each time you acknowledge your progress, you strengthen the new neural pathways you're building in your brain. The more you do this, the easier it becomes to make positive choices. At the same time, it's crucial to take action. 
Visualization and positive thinking are powerful tools, but they need to be backed up with real-world steps. If you're working toward a healthier lifestyle, commit to exercising regularly or preparing more nutritious meals. If you're aiming for financial abundance, take steps to improve your skills, manage your money better, or explore new opportunities. The universe responds to your energy and your actions, so make sure you're aligning your efforts with your desires. One thing to remember, transformation is a journey, not a destination. There will be highs and lows, days when you feel like you're making incredible progress and days when you feel like nothing is happening. Trust the process. Just because you can't see immediate results doesn't mean change isn't taking place. Think of it like planting a seed. You don't dig it up every day to check if it's growing. You trust that with time, water, and sunlight, it will sprout. Your new reality is growing beneath the surface. Surround yourself with positive influences, people who inspire and uplift you, environments that reflect your new mindset, and practices that keep you grounded in your vision. Whether it's through meditation, journaling, or simply taking time to reflect, make sure you're staying connected to your goals every day. This consistent connection will help you stay on track and ensure that your new reality becomes a tangible part of your life. I really hope you enjoyed this video. See you in the next one.